Okay, welcome to my little design table here. I want to show you how quick and easy this can be. So I've used the two of the new colors, mixing them together. And this really takes a lot of a lot of water. Here's what I've done so far, but I figured you're going to look at this and think, oh yeah, right, I can do that. So let me just show you how quick it is. Okay, how easy. Just don't think too much. I think that's what happens for a lot of us is we just get into thinking too much. So you get a soft brush. You need a lot of water mixed with the paint, those two colors. And then I'm being inspired by my um, uh, my flowers that I've got in a vase here. See, they're there. Apple, crab apple buds. Okay, so I'm, you put down the first color, and you can see. You don't want to think a lot. You want to just get the vibe of the flower. Okay, so that would be enough right there. I'm going to clean up my brush. I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to get the, the green, which I mixed the two greens. And... Again, you need the water to get this to float on when you're doing the brush work instead of the stenciling. So you get your brush full, you look at your cool your cool branch, and you start laying in some some branch pieces. Yeah, look how fun that is. Oh my gosh. It's a little crazy. I'm trying to hold my phone and do this at the same time. <laughs> okay. So you can see um, that's enough. Okay, now the last thing that I might do is I'm going to go in here with uh, possibly a little bit of white. And this one's, you know, you can wait till it's dry or not. Um, I tend to, once I get started, I kind of want to do it. But this white part could be really nice to wait until it's dry. I'm not waiting. That's the story of my life. But if you know me, you know that's how it works. Okay. So, oh my gosh, I actually kind of love how this looks. So if I lay this down so you can actually see something that's been inspiring me. I've got the white. I'm going to put a little bit in. You can see how that pops it forward on this background, which is a lot of the light color washed on there first, and that does have to dry. Okay? So... Leaves could happen. Leaves could be that brighter color. This one right here could be that one mixed with a little bit of this. Again, remember to get the water in there. And leaves are really like, put that brush down and then let it kind of drag back to a shape. So you can see you could, you could add some leaves to this or, or not. You could go back with some stitching, which could be really fun too. Okay. So that's it for now. <laughs> Enjoy the new paint colors.